afternoon from Amsterdam. My name is Ivana and right now I am making a salad for myself because I'm very hungry. Uh, I did have breakfast but I didn't vlog that because I was just being slow. And also today we are doing something very exciting. Something that I wanted to do for a really, really, really long time. Make paneer at home. Yes. Paneer princess is making paneer. But in the meantime, look what I'm doing. So usually I would roast my chickpeas, but right now I'm not in the mood. And I do always need something warm in my salad because otherwise, you know, it's cold outside eating salad. So that's why I always put something warm in it and then I like a salad. But otherwise, yeah, I don't like it. This is a salad that looks like it's only spinach, but it's not. Mm. I also have avocado, tomatoes, and um, the chickpeas, the chenna. <laughs> I wanted to put in cucumber, but I'm so hungry, so I'm just gonna eat it like this. Alrighty, I fixed my hair, and now it's time to get milk, because to make paneer, you need milk. It's a cottage cheese, by the way, if you didn't know. Very soft cheese, and apparently, according to the recipe, it's very easy to make, so... <laughs> Let's go! Can you see how dark and gray it is? Okay, let me not hit that car, but like honestly, it's 4 p.m. <laughs> the joy. Well, this shopping party started really random with me buying a stick mixer, spiralizer, random. <laughs> Yos got the groceries. Let's make some paneer, baby. This is it. We're making paneer. Homemade paneer. So what I got here, full fat milk. And actually the recipe is for one liter, which makes about 200 gram of paneer. But because I'm princess paneer, I am making two liters or maybe like 400 grams of paneer. Um, so we need the milk, a little bit of lemon juice, and that's it. Oh, and a cloth. But it's supposed to be really, really easy. So this is the first thing we're gonna do. We're gonna boil the milk. Boil the milk, boil the milk. Okay, pour it up, pour it up. Watch it all fall out. I actually hate boiling milk because it always overflows. I'm just too impatient for it. So always turn up the heat, like way too much, and then it overflows. Damn it, second pack, come here. It's quite hard to do with one hand, okay. There we go. Pour it up, pour it up. Alrighty. Okay, now this has to boil. There we go, what did I say would happen? <laughs> Luckily I was standing here and I already turned the heat down. Okay, so now we add four teaspoons of lemon juice. Wait, let me just first clean this up because otherwise that's gonna stink. Okay, let's do this. So when the milk boils, you add the lemon juice and then the milk starts to curdle. And when it's completely curdled, then we take it off the heat. Okay. Okay, I think this recipe sucks because I've been boiling this milk for five minutes and nothing's happening. I just looked up a YouTube video and she uses a lot more lemon juice, so I'm going to add more lemon juice. I've added a whole lemon now. Now this looks better, right? It's supposed to look like this and it's supposed to... Uh, well, the whey is supposed to separate from the curd. Yeah, curd. Yes, this looks a lot better. Okay, so whole lemon on two liters of milk. Yes. Come to mama paneer. Yes. This is what it's supposed to look like. Okay, I'm going to drain the whey. Be back in a sec before I burn myself. Ladies and gentlemen, we have potential paneer in the house. Okay, this first needs to cool off and then I can drain more whey and then put a weight on it and then we still have to wait for 30, 40 minutes. Okay, where are the lights? Come on, lights. Where are you? Oh, here's it. Come on. Really? No? Okay, whatever. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. It's a sensor. Don't be afraid. It's not ghosts. <laughs> okay, gotta drain this. Ugh, it's still hot. But it's okay. 
with quite heat proof hats. Oh. Okay, now I have to put this on a plate, make a little uh, disc of it. Where do I have a plate? The kitchen is such a mess. Thank you. Okay, move, move, move. I need a plate. There we go, a plate. And then I'm making a disc of it. Like this. Okay, you can't see that. Wait. Stupid light. And then I think I have to put a weight on top of it. Should I just put this? Yeah. I should just do that. Like this. Okay. And then let it sit for 30 to 40 minutes. Which gives me enough time to edit a video. But first, let me just close the curtains. La, 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 la. I'm so excited. Have you ever made paneer at home? I know a friend of mine has and she actually texted me because she said, oh my gosh, it's so easy. You can just make it at home. And I said, I know, I'm just too lazy to ever do it. And now it took me like 45 minutes. So I think that's quite a long time. Hmm, maybe you should do this like the day prior that you want to eat it. Oh well, I'm just gonna edit a video now and then we can check out the paneer later. I let the paneer sit for an hour. Let's check it out, did this work? Did this work, will it blend? What does it look like? Oh my gosh, we actually have paneer over here. Oh wait, it's, it is set. Look at this, it's firm. I am going to cook right now. And also, do you know what I found in my little spice drawer? Look at this, I had this. Shahi paneer masala. I don't think I'll be making shahi paneer because Indians work a lot with paste, so onion paste, tomato paste, yada yada. Too much work for me, I just cut it up. No, actually the Indian way is easier, but you have those brilliant freaking blenders and I don't have that so I will just cut up the onion cut up the tomatoes and then nom, have a paneer next time I would press it a little bit more because now it's falling a little bit apart but let me try it <laughs> it's so good it's so good I made homemade paneer oh my gosh it's so good oh my gosh what was the Tupac song again all I need in this life is me and my paneer. <laughs> oh my gosh, if you're thinking, why the hell is she eating it with spinach? One, I have a ginormous bag of spinach that I need to finish. And also, I'm too late to cook rice and I don't feel like waiting like another half an hour. Yes. By the way, if you're wondering, where's Stefan? Uh, he's in London, so we're not eating together today. And he will be coming back tomorrow evening. Sometimes he has to go up and down. There are some people who are asking me again why Stefan doesn't want to be on camera. He's an artist manager and he feels the artist should always be in the spotlight. So even way before he met me, he would never um, take pictures with other people. You know those party pics? He's never in them. So uh, when I started vlogging, he was like, babe, I never did this and I'm not going to do that right now. And I was like, yeah, fine. I know you always did that. So. <gasps> Paneer, 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 come here, my love. Oh. I feel so good about this. Mm. Mm. This is so good. Oh my gosh, the fresh paneer. Wow. Mm. Mm. And you know what's the best part? You can make the chunks as big as you want to. Mm. Because sometimes they give those little chunks and then you. It's hard to um, taste it, but. Oh, this is so good. I can make my own baby paneer pizza. Oh, 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 the possibilities. The possibilities. I can make my own paneer burger. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, my wish has been granted. <laughs> okay, I'm going to enjoy this paneer. I hope you enjoyed it too. Mm? Your girl is very happy with this. Mmm. Mmm.
Well, this has been an amazing day. I hope you enjoyed it too. We are going to watch a Bollywood movie. Yes, they're showing Bollywood movies in Amsterdam movie theaters. Um, there's this movie, e Fikre? Something like that. If you would like to hang out with me tomorrow again, click that subscribe button. And if you like this vlog, put a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.